Hello folks, we're just going to do a quick test run of this randomizer. Um, just give me a couple of minutes and we'll get started. Okay, to the uh, uninitiated, I, uh, I've never done a randomizer before, um, but this one just looks far too funny to ignore, so I'm just going to give it a, a, a bit of a test run tonight. Jedi stood hello, welcome. Uh, so like I say, um, yeah, never done, never done a randomizer before, and this one is, just from what I've seen, the clips and everything online, is just absolute hilarity. Look, it's art. Even, even these little, even these videos are... There's an arm. There's arms coming out the floor. Aaron, hello. Um, yeah, so never. I'm no good with randomizers. Um, we're probably going to get like tyrants or Birkins in the first first street. Um, I've never done one before. This is my literally my debut randomizer. Uh, so uh, <laughs> I've no idea what it's going to go. How it's going to go? It's Thursday. It's a school night. We've got Stella in hand. I've got COVID. Don't drink um, while you've got COVID. Don't don't be like me. There we go. Right. I don't know what character I'm going to be. Everything is set to random. Items. Everything. Characters. Monsters. The only thing that's not random is the doors. So the actual geography and structure of the game is intact. Bioran. <laughs> Bioran. So uh, place your bets on what you and who you think we're going to be. During a test run earlier, I had Mikhail, Carlos, and Richard. A bizarre incident occurred in the outskirts of an American suburb. Red wine, no school. Tomorrow for the Irish. Oh, wow. Pat oh, congratulations for St. Patrick's Day. Disaster had been caused by the T virus. Not a Guinness drinker then, Aaron. By the international As many of your brethren will be, of course. For use in bioweapon experiments. Anyway, who are we going to get? Ooh. Red. This is the seamless HD project as well, just for additional. We arc. We've got moths. <laughs> what a perfect debut! What a perfect debut to have arc. It's like it's like it's like the world knew. Annette Birkin, <laughs> my husband is the man responsible for the creation of the T virus. William Birkin. <laughs> Liar. Give it back to me. Get on the train. Hurry. <laughs> G. G. Virus. Can't kick you fired. Hello. William is still alive. <laughs> I've got a flamethrower. Winslow. <laughs> hello. Jerry. <laughs> I promise. Don't cry anymore, Lily. <laughs> what? I see. Another spy sent by Umbrella, right? Let me guess. You're here to steal my husband's G virus, aren't you? <laughs> I'll just leave her to her arc. Um, so all the items are randomised, but they look like their original items. So, God, what have I got? I've got. Oh no, is this going to crash if I. Uh, have I got the debug mode enabled? No, I haven't. Curses. <laughs> Fuel. <laughs> yeah. What if I, what if I talk to her? What would she say? I've heard that name before. <laughs> oh no! How can I not get? 
Because you can't discard anything. I want that Desert Eagle. This is what you ha used to have to do years and years ago, you know, before Zero came along. Chemical fuel. That won't go, will it? 2% out. Yes, there we go. Sounds just as good as the original, right? Whoa! That's a dying monologue. Ooh. I should have enabled the debug because you can get um, with random with this randomizer apparently um, locked out of certain sequences. Um, oh god, look at that upgradable magnum already. Jack's on deck. Hello, welcome. We're we're, we're Ark Thompson. Who, who would have asked for a better debut? with this, aren't I? Jesus. Vince, uh, maybe, maybe, maybe Vincent will be Marvin. Who knows? I've got to ditch some of these items, though. During a test earlier, I had um, every zombie was Mr. X in this room earlier. And then I had Ivies on the second run. And it's spiders. That's not too bad. That's not too bad. Even as an arachnophobic, that's not too bad. Dogs. <laughs> run, Ark! So this is the latest build of the um, Seamless HD project, and um, I'm pleased to report. Uh, problem, I, I, I wish I could say it was at my behest, but uh, 1969 has been removed from all the RPD badges. I consider this a rousing success. I mean, I can get the card there, but let's let's see who Marvin is. Place your bets. Of myself. <laughs> Calm down. Go ahead. Hurry. We'll meet at the station. You made it. I don't know what went on between you two, but you have them all wrong. My brother is not the kind of person you think he is. Right. <laughs> no way! <laughs> Poor Claire. You hide here. I'll go find your brother and then come back for you. Wait, do you think he's going after Sherry? <laughs> That's okay. You keep it. 
I'm sure it'll keep you safe. <laughs> it's just a key card, Claire. Don't worry about it. A picture. <laughs> We're never gonna make it. <laughs> Who are you? Put that down. I won't harm you. I promise. Oh. This is too much. <laughs> it just locks the dog. Oh. I can't even pick up the key card. Oh, <laughs> the wizard has. Wizard. Stop it, Aaron. Oh no, I can't. Look at this randomizer. I'm gonna. Because I haven't got. I, I can't pick up the key card. That's why the key card's here, in case you don't get it. Got to fire a shotgun, then use uh, Classic Rebirth's tactical reload. There we go. Get these doors unlocked. I can't believe some parts of that conversation actually played out okay when they started talking about like your brother. That was unbelievable. Uh, absolute mad lads that made this. I am slain. So all the right, so the files stay the same then, okay. That's a really great art model though, isn't it? I was going to re-listen to the RE Survivor podcast today, yep. Good, good one, that. I enjoyed that. I, I really enjoy the uh, 20, 20th anniversary ones. Uh, he has an item on him usually. The manhole open, I'll take it now. I imagine that will always be a lick of that one just for the sake of the cutscene. I don't know whether this version of the game has the item in the corner over here. Some some do. I can't. I, my memory is that bad that I can't actually remember the parameters of that. Which mode that is? Whether it's just a range mode or Japanese version or anything. God, I love this game. Even even in this uh, <laughs> this crazy re um, revision. Um, this this is so timeless for me. This game is. I adore it so much. Oh, no, 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 that's not good. Oh no, 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 no. Resident Evil will never be better than this game. Well, I mean. As if, as if they've done that. That's a big thing for you to say, that Aaron, because obviously the the uh, the remake is obviously extremely dear to you. Not going to be able to do much without a blue herb. Hope that one of these red herb <laughs> fucking precinct key. Wasn't sure whether that'd be open. Uh. I'm just gonna have to keep going, we're just gonna have to keep forging a path. But I'm poisoned. We're not far enough into it to warrant a, a save just yet, so. If 
we if, if we uh, if we die, I'll I'll do a new randomizer. Never played the remote without the classic audio. Yeah, I mean, for a time I played it with the with the classic audio, but then I changed my mind on that. Um, as much as we've chastised Neptune for it over the years, I have changed my mind on it now, and I just kind of embrace the difference of the remakes now. But you know, the sewers with the Marshall and Yard, Yard music is it's, it's indescribably good. Go. Mark's in a bad way. Blue herb. <laughs> Another precinct key. Wow. When you do a revisit, hurry to her on a podcast. Yeah, absolutely. I'll. What, you can. You, I tell you what, Aaron. You can consider yourself booked on that one. If people haven't seen it, it's the same seamless HD picture. I think they did a great job of this. A really great job. They don't look like those creepy AI faces. They've actually gone in and done. You know, a lot of work to actually match the original art. I think it's exquisite. The red key card. <laughs> well, hey, I don't need to go. Uh, I know. No, I do, don't I? A blue worm! Ah! <laughs> right, let's see who we get. Who is going to assume the role of Claire in this playthrough? The small key. <sighs> I have to take it so the game continues, I think. What are you saying? It's Claire, but with random oh, audio. My head. You. You look familiar. Oh. But I just can't remember. Shh. Don't be afraid. I'm not going to hurt you. What is the tape you are listening to? <laughs> You tell him, Claire. Oh God, I've got, I've got too many keys. Can I actually do anything with these keys? I can go down into the basement already. No oh. moths. So I've actually got. I'm just trying to think of the bloody structure of the game. So I can actually go. I can actually go and see, not Marvin. Diamond cake. Oh, if that's poisoned me again, man. Unbelievable. Huh. These keys are for the, the bloody east side, aren't they? Pulled 
through the uh, pull through the wall at this rate. I think I don't think we're gonna last very long. These spiders have been the uh, end of me on on this particular playthrough. Always a Claire, never a Leon. <laughs> Always a pleasure to be here for the rando. It's not going very well. Welcome, by the way. Thank you for the uh, follow I saw you about three hours ago. Thank you. I appreciate all the follows. Um, but you're not going to see me <laughs> at my best tonight, I don't think. Um, I don't know whether people are aware. This is my first ever randomizer, and I was, wasn't expecting it to go well, and uh, it's living up to living up to every expectation as we hunt for a blue herb. Poorly timed. We're going to be limping again before long. Bloody valve handle now. Zombies are so clean and sharp. They are. Yeah, I mean it's the it's the seamless H. Jesus. It's the seamless HD mod, and I know some people have have some issues with the you know certain certain details and and whatnot looking almost like a watercolor <laughs> God, here we go Either do, do or do not as they say yes indeed thank you Another one. Run arc. It replaces all the enemies, all the items, uh, the, the characters are swapped, the dialogue is completely random which just leads to some some absolute nonsense. <laughs> I just need some healing. Well hey. Come on, Ark. Oh, fucking ribbon. B scenario, there's something in here. Huh? Another ink ribbon, oh my god. 
Leon needs you, Ark. Was that a bit of frustration? No, no, no. You're not on a randomizer. How can you be frustrated with a randomizer? It's just, it's just look at the draw. And uh, I had a bad seed, a diamond. I need a diamond key. I'm trying to think what the, what the doors are. I need the spade key and the diamond key. I think you can do that with this one. Um, always a Claire, never a Leon. Um, I'm not. I, I'm not experienced enough to do stuff like that because I've seen. I've seen a couple of the um, remake ones, and you've got to remember like where each door leads to, and it just. It's just it's, it's beyond it's beyond my capacity. I've always got to enjoy the double D cap. Come on, Ark, you can do it. Okay, spade key. Ah! <laughs> right. Because I bet the game's going to give me a, a healing item now and I can't pick it up. No, just more, more red herbs. <laughs> this is excruciating. It's so unfair. Oh, thank God. We are ba <laughs> We're back in business. See, looking well. I'm not too bad. I'm a bit, a bit heavy in the head tonight. Um, so we've got ibuprofen and um, and to uh, perfectly counteract the ibuprofen. Why not? Was this a moth? Another spider. I'm not as literally as soon as I've cleared the poison there's gonna be another one come on you big big bastard just shotgun shells no bruise I've, I've uh, to, to those who are unaware I am um, I actually have COVID at the minute so I'm isolating at home. Um, not too bad. I haven't even got a temperature or a loss of taste or anything. It's just it's just basically like a cold. But I probably shouldn't. I probably shouldn't be drinking, but the randomizer invites such a thing. <laughs> Zombies.
I bet this gore looks so goofy to people who are used to like, you know, the stuff that's in the in remake four. When you had nothing to compare it to, it looked great. Who is our Ada going to be? I can't think of anything better to do than play our beloved Aria. Absolutely. At least the puzzles aren't random. Some of my earliest gaming memories are watching my dad play through the first three games. So this is cozy as hell. Thank you. Yeah, I mean, obviously it's going to be uh, an ambition of mine to introduce this to my uh, to my son in particular. But he's only, he's only four at the minute, so it's a little bit, little bit, little bit way off. I don't know. What, I picked up the red key card, but I can't remember what I did with it. we go. Who is it? It's Ada. The game's sticking true. Sorry. Hand it over. <laughs> what? We finally arrived. There must be something hidden here. <laughs> so then I'm Ark. And not Vincent. <laughs> True. About what? <laughs> right here. <laughs> Good God, what was that? I just feel like I've been playing RE2 all these years and I just put my glasses on so much less definition. Yeah, I mean, I mean this 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 HD project is is something else. I and I do want you know, and I say this as someone who's a purist um, in a lot of ways, but the backgrounds are rough on modern TVs. If you're playing on a CRT, they're they're absolutely fine, but you, you, if if you play these these games on a monitor or a, a modern TV, the pixels are rough. You're talking about like in some cases, like some of the backgrounds, I think 240 by 160. You know, pixels are then they're not great, and so this really this really does make them more accessible to people. Whoa! Oh, yes, I remember. I remember everything. <laughs> Ada just turned into Leon. We've got the manhole cover. We came prepared. Who's going to be in the cell? Who is going to be in the cell? His pen. We're oh God, we're getting them all. Getting it. This is this pretty strange randomizer. It's keeping a lot intact. Who? Uh, <laughs> Bitter irony. <laughs> the chief of police, a <laughs> co-conspirator. So, they'd been recording conversations for evidence. If you don't want to believe it, I don't believe it. <laughs> You're about to die anyway. <laughs> what do you want? I'm trying to sleep here. <laughs> Shit. Uh. <laughs> Precisely. My husband, William. Those zombies aren't the only things crawling around out there. 
factory. <laughs> I don't know anything. And even if I did, why would I want to tell you? Oh, <laughs> my chest! <laughs> it's burning! Wait! <laughs> get... Get away! <laughs> what? <laughs> You're human. What? You must be the leader of the cleaner unit sent by a <laughs> to destroy the evidence of this biohazard. Get that <laughs> scum. Make him pay. What's that? A helicopter? <laughs> There's a kennel in the back of the building. Inside the kennel is a manhole. Go yeah. through and it'll lead you to the sewer entrance, but it won't be easy. I have it right here, officer. <laughs> but I'm not about to leave this cell. Get away from me. You just want my husband's key cell, don't you? But no one will take that away from me. No one. I think if the audio file is longer, Mish, it just hangs in the, the last frame of the animation until the next one, you know, naturally leads in. And if it's shorter, you just get that awkward delay. I have it right here, officer. <laughs> but I'm not about to leave this cell. As long as I'm in 4.3, thank you at least for playing in 4.3. Thank you for appreciating um, original aspect ratios. So at a normal reasonable distance. I think the PS3 does some sort of, like, not reasonably decent smoothing. Um, on PS1 emulation, so it, it does mitigate it somewhat. A nice abundance of um, handgun ammo, but actually nothing to fire it with. There's going to be like Birkins down here or something, isn't there? It's going to be, it's going to be something deeply unpleasant. Zombie hands. Amazing. Oh no. Director's cut via PS4, PS5 emulation is also great. If they can do that for RE2. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. I mean, I'm so surprised it hasn't happened yet. Especially because they're there on the PS3 store. Knife, uh, herb for now. Let's see what this item is. Submachine gun. My god. So, we shall see what happens here then. I'm disappointed though, Mish, in one sense that we still, <coughs> despite them saying it, haven't got directors cutting 60 hertz yet. Is, is, is like Abe's Odyssey the only one that, that we've actually got the NTSC version available on the PS5 store? What was Ada. that all about? Running off like that was reckless and stupid. One last thing. Here's a radio. Take it. I've turned into Leon. Just rest here for now. Claire should be back soon. I was there, Leon. I know. <laughs> Leon. So will will I be Ada in the next bit, or will will that randomise as well? I'm Ada. Ah! 
the zombie hands bursting out of hatches. Hopefully this sliding box puzzle isn't too uh, too taxing for for GT. This can't be that random. I just think that this seed's been particularly well, unfortunate. I mean, it's given us nearly ex exclusively RE2 characters pretty much as well, whereas earlier on I was getting RE3 characters. <laughs> All that for a green herb. shotgun shells, that's the spoils for this section. So I presume you just run back and whatever the item that was in the place of the valve handle, not the valve handle, that's scenario B. The club key will just trigger the cutscene to play back. An amanet randomly. Even worse, every G virus bioweapon, including Lillian, has the ability to implant embryos into other creatures. Who are you? Where did you get that? Brandon? <laughs> it looks exactly like the one I gave Sherry. Now, where's that spy you were working with earlier? You know who I'm talking about. John's dead. He became one of those zombies. My condolences. <laughs> no. This is me. I am Vincent. It was all my fault. Um, are you all poised for the remake four episode? Uh, I've got the day off. I've got the Friday off. Um. If the game is anywhere near the comparable length to the original, um, then not quickly. Especially because we're, we're reasonably, you know, not to not to go down a not to go into too much detail, but obviously we're all quite poorly at the moment in the house, which you know, hopefully by next Friday we'll all be over it. Um, but yeah, provided we get a good run at it, and I'd like to think I can get it sort of the majority of it cracked that weekend. Unless it's like a 20 hour campaign, and then it'll be a bit longer. But I would say Nick will probably be the. He'll probably. Um, zombie hands. Um, he's got he's to get that parrying mechanic down, hasn't he? And as we saw in the uh, in the demo stream he did, uh, he doesn't even entertain it. I don't even think he even tried one parry, did he? We'll have another outbreak. Oh god, I will. we haven't had many outtakes. You know, it's funny because through the through the year of recording or the years of recording, the the outtakes podcast builds and builds with each new recording. We you know chop bits out and whatnot. And the last few podcasts have gone alarmingly well with very little tangents or weird things happening. We've all got pretty decent recording equipment now and you don't have a lot of the audio problems. Um, we've got ways of you know, isolating certain audio now because we use a Discord recorder which means everybody's audio is recorded separately now which is why we can get rid of a lot of the background noises and 
claps and bangs and things. So yeah, the outtakes thing is not really getting getting built up as much these days. Nick doesn't understand the mechanics of an RE game, or not. but like I said in the um, in one of the Discord threads, as much as we all mock him for not embracing mechanics, you know, even even like you know like basic ones like you know the the quick heal in RE7, he still manages to get the job done, and that's what's that's what's commendable. This is why the parrying mechanic with the Krauser fight is going to be one of the first real tests for him, I think, because there is a mechanic you're going to have to adhere to. It's not really optional. It's like, that you, you know, if you, if you wanted to, you can get through RE3 um, Remake without using the dodge. Yeah, you're making the game harder for yourself, but it's not... 100% needed, you can still do it without, it, you know, certainly if you play on assisted where there's, there's not really any challenge at all, but it looks like that Krauser fight is specifically built around the parry mechanic and, the, and the, the, you know, the evades and whatnot, so I don't really, if, if you refuse to use that or choose not to use it, then I don't know how well you're going to get on um, it could be one of the first sort of real <laughs> walls that he faces what do you use bow rounds on circuit code Veronica? Jocelyn, hello, welcome. Obsessed with this mod, it's so much fun. We've got a, I've got to be brutally honest with you, it, it's quite a dull quite a dull seed this one. There's been a few moments of absolute hilarity, but for the most part it's been quite mundane. Um we've had to run around looking for blue herbs for ages, but that's about it. Kakiki fired, they were a great episode, it's almost a shit you get the shit together more nowadays. I mean yeah, I mean one of the things that you probably won't see, Kakiki fired. Is um, like the 15 minute tangent that happened in the Outtakes 1 podcast, which was all the George Trevor clats and bangs and things. It, it's just frankly, um, it was just frankly unbelievable in those early days. You just, just how, how, how an individual is capable of so much chaos. During a recording was just extraordinary. I knew that was locked. I usually use it to just randomise items, and that's it. Yeah, I mean it's is pretty tricky. Uh, pretty items-wise, it's pretty tricky. Neptune, Neptune can do RE zero. I normally can achieve anything. The tricky game is zero. It's such a such a conundrum. It's got it's got an easy mode. I think you were saying something like this, um, Mish, on the Discord the other day. How sometimes like you have a normal mode that's too easy and a hard mode that's way too hard. And in in some ways you've got three quite three quite different difficulty settings in um, in Resident Evil Zero. You've got You've got easy, which is just way too easy. Like there's no challenge in that game if you play it on on easy. Normal's a big step up from that, and hard is like properly nails. Like zero. This is you. Let's see what happens then. Yeah, I, I totally agree, Josimar. Is there a hard deadline for the MP3 callings for the podcast for remake four? Not at the minute. Yeah, you just just fire him in whenever. We'll we'll put a call. We'll put a shout out um, on Twitter or whatever when they have to be in by. But there's no there's, there's certainly no rush. We're not gonna. If we all start playing it on the day it comes out, I would say we'll still be a good couple of weeks off recording. Just to make sure as well. The crank's there, okay. I 
Another flamethrower. I personally think anyone who's finished Resident Evil 4 will fly through this remake. I suppose it depends. It, it depends how changed later parts of the game are. When we're running around El Nesto instead of the island facility. We're thinking the main game of RE4 is going to be shorter than OG4. I, I hope so. And I don't <coughs> I don't mean that in a, in a negative way. I actually think tightening up and shortening the the, the game's runtime would actually be hugely beneficial. <laughs> Bloody hell! Would be hugely beneficial for the game and it and, and its pacing. Maybe you always get. Oh no! That was a bad call. Watch them shorten the village and island section to expand the castle. God, I, I hope not. The, the castle's where I have the biggest problem. I, I genuinely think if you... And I've said this no end of times before, so apologies for the repetition, but... Chapter 4 as a whole pretty much just could be done to just do away with altogether. I want to get, beat the game before checking on what other people have to say about it. Yeah, absolutely. I always think you should... It's one of the reasons why I, I won't ever... Unless, unless there's a very specific exception, I would generally always like to play through an RE game first on my own. You know, before I consider streaming it. I did, I did enable the debug mode, that's neat. Because it just, it's just nice to have that, that pure experience the first time. I actually finished. Even though I've had it since it came out, so I've had it for what, like 18 months? Um, I actually finished RE4 VR today. And of the three Resident Evil VR experiences so far, I actually do think it's the weakest. It's still great, it's still fun, it's enjoyable, but it's a very, very broken game. It's just not designed for all the... the stuff you can do... No, that's the wrong way. Uh, all the stuff you can do in it. Like the Krauser fight is just laughable in VR. It, it is literally no challenge. You just stun lock him with the knife, and because, even though he shifts and whatnot, you you can just match him because the VR, you know, the, the, your turning speed is how fast you can physically turn. Which sounds great, but it just it, it totally breaks it. And like the final fight with um, Sadler it is just comical because you've got just so much precision aiming that hitting like the eyes on his legs is is easy. And it downs him almost straight away. Yeah, it's it's a, it's a very broken experience, and and I actually would say it's not the definitive way to play the game. It it's fun, it's cool. That demo was hard. I, I you know I've still not done it on Mad Chainsaw yet. Replayability has always been a key part of the franchise. Beat the remake two, three times in four days. Wow. I meant to actually, because I seem to think... I was thinking about this earlier when I finished the VR version. I ought to go back through all the versions of RE4 I own. Because I'm pretty sure the clear game tells you how many times you finished it and actually total up how many times I've actually been through that game. I don't even know why I've come up here. Slightly disconcerting, we've not had any plugs yet. Thank <laughs> you. 
Can you actually hit them? You can't, can you? Oh my god. That, am <laughs> that aiming was absolutely terrible. Been playing the original RE2 and RE3 since 2000. So it's impossible to likewise, yeah. I can, uh, it's very easy to sort of, with bravado, say, oh yeah, I probably played through RE2 over a hundred times, but I maybe have, you know. RE4 VR memes. The ones where players complained about Ashley was now too tall, but the players were just short. Absolutely, yeah. I mean, I am a naturally short person. Um, so Ashley is taller than me. First plug. Can't do much with that plug just yet. But I'm sure I don't, I've got the valve handle, haven't I? I haven't. Where was that? Can anyone remember where the valve handle was? Where did I leave the valve handle? Love to watch a third person RE4, in which Ashley is just a head or two taller than Leon. <laughs> Not because she is tall, but because he isn't. <laughs> well, hey, Tom Cruise isn't tall, so. In an office within an office inside the East Office in 1F. Oh hey, yeah, absolutely. I've I've seen it. I've picked it up, but I can't remember where it was. Crows. It's not going to give me another one though, is it? Let's be honest. Just more handgun bullets. In fact, why did I do that? Why did I pick that up? Fucking magnum bullets. Why have I still got... There's someone else. I've seen... I've seen the valve handle somewhere. I don't know where it is. Get off me crows. Bollocks. I've got randomizer on though. Jack's on deck. That's the problem. It, it's it's another one of those items that I've already I've already seen somewhere. Oh, I can't remember which one it is. I thought I'd picked it up. Anyone with a really good rem memory remember which one? Remember where the valve handle was? Because I can't. <laughs> I can't remember. Oh, 
because the shutters came down, didn't they? Couldn't see, couldn't see. I've already got that item, okay, that's fine. Resident Evil 2 is a survival horror game that was released in 2019. No. God, if it's not if it's not in the dark room, I genuinely I know I saw it fairly early in this run. It's either in here or it's in the star's office. And it's not in here. It must be the star's office then. Uh, Justin, I'm looking for the valve handle. And I've already seen it somewhere. Wasn't it in the cabin outside? No, because it's the ra this is the randomizer. So it, although it looked like the valve handle, it actually wasn't. <laughs> God damn moth! Near the vending machines. Oh, was it in the east office? Well, there's the diamond key at last. Thinking at East Office, then the herb near the near the vending machines in the East Office. Are you thinking? Shit! I nearly got I nearly got caught out there. <laughs> well, at least we can go through the. Um, we can go see who Marvin is. If I get Mr. X is in that storage room, I'll never forgive this game. The Midwest summer of 1998 was too warm. Have you have you researched that, Mish? So this is the herb. Mr. X has key items on him and I've never checked that out. Um, I don't know on the randomizer whether he would do. But thankfully he doesn't show up in... well... 
I mean, I suppose he can show up in scenario A, but he shouldn't do. And I, 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 I can only assume that the um, the randomised Mr. X's don't carry items. It'd be nice to get some shotgun parts. But I assume the randomizer keeps each section of the game's items within itself, so you can't sequence break it too hard or, or be given items you can't use yet. Incredible shout, Aaron. Incredible. Well, well remembered. Autumn Fall 1998, not summer. Jill's attire is the approved vine. Yeah, okay, yeah, fair enough. Had you remembered that, or was that just a good guess? Or. Unicorn medal. Okay, that's neat. We'll see what this is for. Oh, the other medal. Gonna have to leave some more magnum bullets behind. I remembered in all serious. Excellent. Well done. Yeah, I saw the um the behind the scenes video mish about that. You know, in a in a poised and ready position. I know everything about the original game not much. Yes, it's what's throwing me, to be honest. We must be, we must be nearly there in terms of items, though, because we've 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 covered all bases. So I can only I can only assume knowing the structure. That doing this puzzle will get me one of the other plug items, and then I just need the cog somewhere to be able to do the last one. Hopefully, they'll be in the um, the art room. Really, since happy birthday, RE3 yesterday. There were some predictions that came true. Specifically that Jill would wander around the art apartment as a tutorial as guessed by Neptune. Oh, very good. He is good. He is good is our Neptune. I got all my Samurai Edge um, predictions wrong though, didn't I? Is it in that episode, Aaron? Is it? Because I'm I'm looking for that for a very specific reason. No items. Oh, that's neat. If it's if it's part of that episode, then that's really good. I know where it is then, because of that very segment. Yeah, I mean it's amazing. They don't happen all that often, but when you do get one of the the Batman breakdowns, we ought to call it that. Um, it wants to be a feature, Batman Breakdown, because uh, he's he's done one for like um, uh, you know the storyline of Revelations, which was amazing.
So I'm hoping in here pretty much will be the last two plugs because, or at least the cog to be able to get the last. There's one of the um, another green herb. That is ridiculous. This is bonkers. I bishop plug. That's great. Thanks. So we've got three of the plugs now. But no cog. I can't even think where it would be. What stone have I not unturned? Uh, what was it? God, the weapon storage, I guess. Yeah, that's the only thing I can think of. Batman must be feel very apprehensive. Uh, no, he's de he's definitely feeling. It's all in the files. It's all in the files. Yeah. Then ne Nick going the Batman. But we'll to introduce it as a as a feature uh, for every episode. The Batman breakdown. Um. He is feeling apprehensive, as we all are. I mean, you have to bear in mind we we are a law, you know, focused podcast initially. You know, and just because we can find merit in the remakes at times, even if I do have drunken stupors where I go off, um, we still try and find merit in them. And I find a lot of merit in what I've played in remake four in that demo. I think it. From a gameplay point of view, I think it's masterful. But there is the worry that with each entry, you are bending the law beyond its breaking point at times. To the point where you do have to actually establish your own little rules in terms of... You know, is there two timelines? You know, is there a split after the first game and you've got the remake timeline on one side and uh, and the OG timeline on the other? And if you can do that, then great. And I think you'll be you'll be a happier person for it, for sure. No crank, no gear. I assume the side pack is an actual thing then. Pink ribbons everywhere. Handgun parts. We've never even had the handgun. Um, I'm at a complete loss then. I know not to where that cog is. Just for the purpose, because this is not a proper run. I'm going to cheat. Don't judge me. What was the last? I can't remember what the last plug it was. Don't judge me. <laughs> but I'm I'm quickly running out of time this evening, and I don't want to. We'll, we'll try and get to like an, at least another bit with NPCs. Shame on you. I know I wouldn't do usually, but there's no there's no fun in just running around for hours trying to find items that I, to me I, I've picked up every single item I've come across, so I, I just can't think where that final piece must be the, the, the cog must be, and I assume the final uh, the final <laughs> the final chess 
um, chess pieces behind that um, thing. I don't mind file exclusions from original to remix, but I do wish new files didn't contradict the old. Yeah, agreed. And as, as as Batman's pointed out, like remake three even contradicts itself in its own files at times because he he's worked out that some of the timestamps in Nikolai's report at the end of the game that you get when he's in the um, in the warehouse actually can't correlate to what happens in the game with the timestamps the game gives you. It's kind of, you know, kind of broken in itself. King... What was it? So, Bishop, King, Rook. So, I need the Queen plug. In fairness, Snips, um, who created the mod, does say that you need to always have the debug mo uh, mode running in, in the event that certain things don't spawn. So it could be that. We'll, we'll give it, give, it, give it the benefit of the doubt. Uh, queen plug. Oh no, why didn't that work? Knight plug? King, Rook, Bishop, Knight. What the fuck's there a Queen? Oh my god, I'm, I'm literally going mad. Queen, it says Queen plug. That's mad. The queen, the queen. It must be, it must be named differently. No boss. Okay. Who is going to be here? <laughs> they are creating these monsters on this island. <laughs> Cannon. It makes Ark sound really creepy. Whoa! <laughs> the wolf medal. Come on, give me the eagle one as well. We've done we've done half the searching then. Oh dear! Finally, an event that makes sense. Absolutely. <laughs> Who's going to be the shooter? That's the thing. Eagle medal. Well, we've done the sewers then. Even, I could even like not need to go around and trigger all the uh, the uh, the cutscenes now. That's that's insane. I got more handgun ammo and no handgun to fire it. I've still not had one this run. I'm gonna try out more mods after this. Um, I mean, I've got the randomizer for the next, um, for the other, you know, RE1 and RE3. So absolutely, this is this is a lot of fun, and it 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 mixes it up a little bit, and it 
I think people are more in, inclined to tune in with the sort of classic games. I have noticed, like when I, you know, you you play some of the more divisive titles, like even like RE7, you just you, people just don't tune in. It's crazy. Raise your hand if you make the constant mistake to not bring this with you. Every time you do this game. I've, I've seen a lot of the Kando mod. I mean, it is. You have to be unhinged to, to tell a story like that. But it is brilliant. Kendo just shooting a net down at the end never fails to crease me. It's Ben! He's escaped the cell! Where did she where did she come from? <laughs> what on earth? How did Oh my god, the Annette slap's gonna be amazing, isn't it? Or the Ada slaps, should I say? Kendo having like four lines and using that to tell the whole story as well, and it becomes a time travelling epic by the end as well. I ain't got no clue, darling. <laughs> it's incredible. Here we go. Who's the shooter? It's Ben again. <laughs> but do you even know how to get out of the city? <laughs> got the story <laughs> and who the heck are you <laughs> I'm trying to find my boyfriend his name's John he was working for a branch office of umbrella based in Chicago but he suddenly disappeared six months ago get get away <laughs> What's it to you? Get out of here before you get <laughs> it right to me. I don't know anything, and even if I did, why would I want to tell you? You know what this is about, so just hand over the G virus. I have it right here, officer. But I'm not about <laughs> to leave this cell. That woman was. I have to talk to her. Damn! I don't believe this! I almost got the story! Oh! My chest! It's burning! I heard a rumor that he's still in the city. <laughs> Those zombies aren't the only things crawling around out there. What? <laughs> just, ben is just so confused. He has no idea what's going on at all. You must be talking about that vagrant Spaniard. <laughs> vagrant Spaniard. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Damn! I don't believe this. Where is the sample? <laughs> I was, I was not expecting RE4 dialogue, Christ. Oh. I don't need this right now. Interesting, yeah, okay. Oh, of course, because I'm Ada, aren't I? Yeah. I see Mr. Bauer has just gone live, and he is going to be doing uh, Resident Evil 3 by Oran later, so uh, that'll be uh, good for a giggle. Ah! I... 
I don't remember anything. This is perfect. Who am I? <laughs> <laughs> that was, that's too perfect. That, is, that, that just goes far too well. God damn dog. I assume the um, the alligator is a lock, irrespective of what seed you've got. Unless we're about unless we're about to see something truly crazy. No. Come on, Ark, quick. That's going to be interesting putting the medals in, isn't it? Could have done it now, but I'm not giving up an additional cutscene. Tyrants. With no hat, you know. The, uh, the superior um, Tyrant 103. Another shotgun. Okay. Christ. I'm actually not going to send that up because I don't need to. God, they've done such a good job with these backgrounds. The, the in the early versions of the Seamless HD project, the AI upscaler made quite a rough job of, of these backgrounds in particular. They look amazing now. Where, where am I? Oh. Yeah, the melted. I mean, that's why they've gone in and um, actually replaced a lot of the text, which is very welcome. I know some. I've seen some criticism that some of the text isn't in keeping with the original art, and I get that. I do get that, and believe me, it would it would bother me more if it wasn't for the fact that the original. The, the sort of melted text that an AI upscaler gets looks way rougher than some of the art, artistic choices they've made. I know, I know which way round I would rather have it. Play the PS1 version quite often. The improvement is insane. Yeah, absolutely. So does this? It's oh my god. We're going to see a Leon and Ark moment. My good friend, Leon S. Kennedy. Find her before, before something happens. <laughs> Lot's bad. What happened to him? Hello? <laughs> you made it. Who is this? Vincent? Who's that? Wait, am I Vincent? I... <laughs> am I on this island? Where did she go? Some strange, some strange shenanigans there. 
We've got the partner character keeps turning into different people. Oh god. God, this is unhinged. <laughs> it literally randomizes the character each. We're in it now. God, this is gonna this is gonna be entertaining, isn't it? Let's be honest. No, I'm, for the purposes of it, I'm not gonna mess about. There's a fair bit of melted text there. I haven't got much time left, so um, yeah, we'll probably we'll get to the marshal in the yard, I think, and then maybe call it a day there. We'll try and get a boss fight done. This was only it wasn't meant to be a full run. I'm actually out, I've played more than I was intending to because it's just it's too it's too much of a riot. I wish I, I do wish I had more time to uh, more time to stream. I'm almost there. I know, I know, I know. I could go. Sherry's here now. I mean, we're going to see Sherry shooting the uh, Burke in hand. Yes. Way to go, Sherry. Sherry shy with her mind. Well, people, chat. I welcome you to one of the greatest ever areas in a Resident Evil game. Hopefully the shotgun parts will still be in the same place. Oh no. Got actual sherry mechanics. Sherry with a jacket on. Please be shotgun parts. Very cruel game, come on, that's cruel. No, oh, my depth perception was poor. as Ada.
What is with all these herbs, man? Sherry is the real BSA material, absolutely. Everything has been a green herb so far, this sucks. And now a blue herb when I don't need one. And another green herb. Hole in the wall was a nice addition because it's not in the original. Yeah, I mean, it, 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 it was in the... Um, oh god, it was in one of the, the beaters. And it makes sense because it, you know, the way the blood trail, I think, is in the original Marshall Inn yard, and it's nice to actually see where it goes. It's one of those things that it's more puzzling that it was, um, it was more puzzling that it was removed than it was retained. Got one, one magnum bullet. I just can't believe there's just been so many herbs. And now we're, we're back as a net. So, um, if I stand here point up to that orange, that, that, sorry, yellow light there, that's on that upright point there. Just beyond that is where the magic, ele the magic elevator elevator shaft should be, shooting up into the sky toward the training facility. Where is it, for the people who still like to tell us that it's an actual piece of established geography? I don't know. Can you save to finish another time? Is that a thing with this rando? We actually can save. That's a good point. I, I will do. No, Leon, no. That's still alive. <laughs> Your brother? What? <laughs> no. Whoa. Leon, that's freaky. What are you doing? N another herb. This game is absolutely trolling now. She's unconscious. Whoa! He's infected. I should totally see that, see that. Yeah, absolutely. Same coat, isn't it, pretty much? And, um, it, you know, it's kind of like a look that Ethan would rock years later as well. so muted for this, that's such a shame. shotgun but since the game just wants to give us herbs we don't actually have it
I tend to have RE2 rehearsed to a point where I only use the, the submachine gun in very specific moments. A railway station? <laughs> what? I used to draw fan out of Birkin through the stages. Oh, very good. They way differently designed. Bad. No, I'm sure they weren't. Every 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 piece of art has merit. This is going to be. I don't always play by your rules. This <laughs> is going to be wild. Stop. I'm just. A woman <laughs> who fell in love with you. <laughs> Nothing more. What? <laughs> what the? That's a large thing you have there. What? <laughs> I really wanted to escape with you. Umbrella. <laughs> so this is where the city is controlled from. Yes, uh, you've got it. Has no idea what's going on. <laughs> <laughs> You're thinking out loud about Ark where? there, Raider. Where? Where are they coming from? <laughs> A fuse case, wow. The main fuse, Jesus. I don't know, then theoretically I don't need the fuse case, do I? Another herb. What is going on with herbs? I even got the even got the, the one for the end. Christ! Let's just we'll still just keep going. I'll, I'll, I'll keep going for a little bit. Okay, if it, if it's sequence broken, we might be able to actually get it finished. I'm gonna I'm gonna need a weapon. Need some magnum bullets or something. Because I ain't gonna do G4 with what I've got, and I'll need some health. Although, does the fact that it give me the fuse case mean I need to actually do that puzzle to get the item that? Because if, God, because if like the MO disc is locked behind that puzzle now, then I'm gonna have to do it, aren't I? If you get the MO, yeah, but exactly, that's what I'm thinking, Josima. If the MO disc is locked behind that puzzle and I don't do it, then I'm never going to get the, uh, I'm never going to get it, am I? So I'm going to have to do it. You, you watch. I'm going to go through all this pain and hardship to get a, a herb. Bring back Ark Thompson. Come on, Capcom. You wanna you wanna do all your remakes? A remake I would actually accept is a remake of Survivor. I would totally go for that. That to me would be resources well spent. Interesting. Another shotgun. Bring back, bring so many characters back, Steve, Art, Wesker. I mean, it must be said. I mean, I've seen like when Maximilian Dude um, did the randomizers the other day. He had, he got some wild encounters, and I don't. We've had some. We've had a couple of good ones, but nothing. 
I told you it would give me a herb. What a complete waste of time. Um, we've not had anything quite to the level that he had. I mean, he, he had, like, Remake 2 Leon saying fuck you to, to a locked sherry behind the, um, behind the cells. It was great. Joking. What the f This could be the end. <sighs> Unbelievable game. Weapon box key. Okay. Of course it would be. If that... If I'd not had the shotgun there and just had the pistol or whatever, that would have been total game over. Remarkable save, yeah. And none jumped either. Leon calls Kendo an overgrown son of a bitch. <laughs> yeah. God, I love the um, the mechanic to get into that room. I, I remember playing this back in the day, and and that kind of well, I suppose they called it the zapping system, didn't they? But like, it it was just amazing, just amazing that you had to open like that doorway over two playthroughs of a game was just like it was it was that kind of thing had never been seen before. Yeah, I ain't gonna trifle with that. Oh no. the game look <coughs> so what actually happens now let me just think of the structure Because I've got the ammo disc, will that trigger? This is going to hurt, isn't it, if I get this wrong? Oh no, 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 no. Back in deer. Back in. It's, 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 a, it's a terrible English thing that we, we have over here. Because I've got the ammo disc now, will this scene trigger? No, it doesn't set up like flags or anything. Interesting. So in some ways, if you... If you're playing this randomizer for the hilarity... And the giggles and whatnot, then you really want to just be playing it with items in the correct places because 
otherwise you sequence break it like we have here and you don't get the full wealth of the cutscenes like we've missed out on some potentially hilarious moments there completely managed to skip this final section because of that. Yeah, it's... I'm a bit torn as to what to do next time then. Whether to just whether to just leave the items in place. Even the game telling you to do things better leave this to Leon and Claire. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, I don't even use the weapon box at the um, armory for um, my A character. I leave I leave both the side pack and the submachine gun for the B character. I've always done that. I got Leon being I got the master key as soon as I got into the lab. No, yeah, see so you, you're just gonna miss out on so much doing that. Handgun rounds. I never got a handgun. I wonder if there shouldn't be a setting that specifically excludes the canon character for the scene just to make it more crazy. Mm. More shotgun shells. Well, the good the good news is we should have enough now to um, easily do. Um, Birkin. I was just really on the lookout for um, more health. Let's take the green herb, and then, uh, well, we may as well we may as well go on, haven't we? And then, we'll, and then we'll raid Sunny. Call it a night. Was hang on be the last thing in the run, yeah. I don't know if there's going to be any more items. I, c I could go into the um, the moth nest, but I don't see a point. Okay, we'll, we'll go and have a look then. I need that key. Key, don't I? Yep. I don't think there's any danger of. Um, I will save it just to be on the safe side. Because uh, the, the G4 battle can always go wrong. Particularly with a shotgun, which isn't the most incredibly fast firing weapon in the world. Single ivy, but no, I thought there was always some herbs in here you could pick up. That's disappointing. Okay, well, we'll go on to finish it then. Now, there is actually something I actually want to look at. As well with the seamless HD background, because um, I was um, Kyle, who works with the seamless HD team, let me um, test a couple of these builds, and I noticed on one of the backgrounds, obviously they fix they fix the spelling of elevator, 
but in one of the other angles you can actually see it, it's the old spelling and I just wanted to see if they actually did fix it. Twenty nineteen. God, was that the last time I actually No, that can't be right. God, I bet it was. Jesus. And time flown. COVID. I tell you, I don't know about you guys, but COVID has is, is completely annihilated any sense of time that I had. Like, I, I would not have said that the last time I played this was four years ago. Steady now. I think of things like, you know, a four year gap since I last streamed, you know, this game. Four years. And you think about, like,. How much you changed or something during secondary school, let's say, or high school, in that time, and it's just gone in the blink of an eye in your adult years. It's, it's, it is truly scary. Elevator platform, elevator. Yeah, you did, they did. It was this. It was this background, I think, where that was the original E, but they have changed it. Good guys. Felt sorry for students during COVID. Yeah, absolutely. May as well use our solitary bullet. Sorry to hear that. It's, uh, it, it truly has redefined life for a lot of people. For the better. Okay, that's fair enough then. Did, did I go into that fight? Seriously, on caution. It's no, it's no wonder I came away with nothing. Spray, didn't we? There we go. Well, we'll try again. Oh, 
Adios, Luca. The highlight of this randomizer for me was definitely Ada talking about the vagrant Spaniard. I was not expecting that. It's scary in the sense that so much has changed in a short period of time. Yeah, it absolutely has. And um, and like a week like this for me, you know, obviously sat here with COVID, unable to, you know, embrace my kids and things like that. It's just it's awful. I've just, I've been in, you know, in one sense like being told to isolate in this room with all my things in it and and whatnot. It ordinarily would be amazing, but it just kind of sucks. Park. Oh. Is that it? My God, I should use that shotgun more. Well, we finished the scenario. There we go. I'm actually having a blast being on Twitch the last day or two instead of YouTube. Oh, that's that's I'm 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 I'm, I'm pleased. Thank you. YouTube can always be a bit of a minefield, can't it, in terms of content? go. Let's skip the ending. I wasn't actually sure if this was a build with the um, the cutscenes with the subtitles taken off because they've actually, I think they've cracked that now. Yeah, the the Source Next FMV is a top notch. It was it was a genuine highlight of the release. It was the like the foot because a lot of people don't and maybe aren't even aware, but like the PlayStation One and the GameCube FMVs are actually cropped top and bottom, whereas the Dreamcast I think is still a little bit cropped, but the the Source Next ones were full frame. You can't skip. You can hit the enter button. Yo, Leon. I've got an A. You will receive less points using a special weapon, but you never actually get told what your points are. You just get a, you just get a rank. <laughs> Image is canon. Wicked. I did say it wasn't going to be a full run, and we ended up doing one just because um, sequence breaking is that fast. Uh, so that is so. Thank you so much for sticking around, guys. That was so much fun. Um, not quite as funny as I was hoping for, because some of the the seeds that it is it given us the seed or whatever it hadn't quite given us the level of random that I was hoping for. I mean, earlier on when I was doing some tests, I got. You know, Mikhail, I got Carlos, I got Richard at one point. Um, 
that was actually quite quite plain in many ways. I mean, some of the interactions were were amazing, but it was it was a bit disappointing to see so much of the original RE2 cast not changed as such. Uh, thanks very much. I will you know, shake this. I mean, it actually feels.